2022 Supreme ZS212. This is our first 2022 we've received this year. Uh, it's in frost white in Bahama blue metal flake. Looking super pretty. It's also got the uh, Roswell Tower up top, the Battle Advance Tower, whatever you want to call it. Um, same thing <laughs> in frost white and Bahama Blue Metal Flake accents. ZS212 comes in at 21 foot, 2 inches. Pickle fork bow. It's a deep boat. has tons of space um, for just a 21 foot boat. It's uh, a lot of seating, a lot of storage, a lot of ballast on this boat. Um, shoot, I left the windshield open. Forgive me for that. Um, it's sitting on a tandem axle Boatmate trailer. And Supreme for 2022 has actually gone through a little bit of rebranding. So you're going to see all new Chromex decals on the side. Black Supreme logo. See they've kind of changed up the font and the look. Same with any of their model insignias. And there's that new Supreme logo. They kind of have like the lightning bolt theme going on. Um, with the new logo there, which looks really cool. So, really pretty boat. We did window tint up on the windshield there. Uh, this boat is going to have all the available ballast. It's about 4,600 pounds. And the quick surf system back here. New feature for 2022 is the silent stinger wake plate. So that's kind of trickled down from the Centurion line. So we now have surf exhaust on these Supremes, which is going to be really, really nice. Um, it's going to be the a quieter operating uh, while you're while you're surfing along or just driving in general. And obviously, not going to get the fumes coming back at you when you're surfing off the back here. Um, going to have a 16 by 13 heavy duty prop on there, and as you can see, tie down straps on that trailer with the big steps out the corners here. A beautiful boat. We're going to hop inside. Go through the interior. ZS's, as with all the Supremes, have a massive sun pad back here. Got this nice step pad on either side. We do have like a storage compartment slash cooler on both sides and the corners. This boat scheme is in white, silver, and black, uh, white main, silver accent or secondary, with a uh, black piping. Just to give it a little bit of an accent through the interior. And then we've gone with the two layer gator step with shark fin underneath, black on top. Looks great. Up on our tower here, we've got the standard rotating, not standard, but um, the base model board racks with the bungees. And they're fully coated, so you don't uh, scratch your board slash damage the board racks with your boards. You even have those tower um, accents through the interior. This does have the Supreme Factory Bimini. Uh, and while we're up on the tower, this boat is equipped with the Champ Audio Package. So this has a pair of Rev 10s up on top. And it has, uh, as we hop down in here real quick, it has six of the eight uh, inch interior speakers. Along with a 12 inch sub down at the driver's feet. So it's a pretty, pretty nice sound in stereo um, in this particular boat. Uh, we've been putting this champ package on a lot of our stuff, Supreme and Centurion alike, and we've been really happy with it. We do have a nice wraparound seating in the ZS, and it is deep. You are sitting down in this thing. You've got a lot of, let me see if I can switch this around. You have a lot of back support in these things. I'm not the biggest guy in the world, but anybody is going to feel pretty secure riding around in a ZS. Let's pop open our storage. You can fit a couple boards across this engine cover. 
can't be super, super big because the bags do rise up as they fill a little bit above this trim piece right here. Um, but they've changed the ZS ballast layout a little bit. It used to have hard tanks in the corners and a plug and play bag here. What they've done is kind of simplify the setup a little bit um, by combining the rear corner tank, the surf tank they called it before, with that plug and play bag. So you just have one large cavity uh, with one single bag um, in each corner. This boat is set up with, I can get it off here with one hand, maybe, there we go. This, boat, this boat's got the PCM 6 liter, 409 horsepower, ready to roll. Again, paired with that uh, heavy duty prop. Gets this boat up and on plane, no problem. Drop that down does have a full boat cover that's kind of stashed down there as you can see lock that down um, underneath all your seats these things just flip up and you've got carpetless storage which is great all of the interior in the boat it's got this nice thick textured vinyl if we get close on it you can see that the stuff's super robust doesn't get super super hot in the sun on this lighter color as well which is nice and nice dense foam on the seats so interiors are built to last do have the optional lean back on the port side top up here OB they've moved the batteries to a much better location for 2022 so instead of being I mean, get my camera straightened out here the batteries used to sit up kind of below the amps here but they've moved them below this seat um, which opens up just much much more useful storage underneath the uh, glove box here you can see I just have a life jacket pack kind of thrown in there um, but I like what they did there little improvements uh, glove box real quick You've got your nice new supreme logo wing on the gator step and then some charging ports, We've got our owner's manuals and things in here, as well as your tool to fold the tower. It's a manual fold tower, it's super, super easy um, to fold that thing up and down. It's assisted. And let's make our way over to the dash. Very similar dash setup to last year. Um, they have given us a clamping phone charger right here, wireless phone charger, which is really nice. And then we have our C-Touch dash uh, where we can control you know, our surf settings, our ballast, and lastly, our stereo and rider presets. So we've got the profiles you can activate and quickly um, quickly get out and surf. Boat kind of sets itself up for you. Got the nice big steering wheel, tri-spoke adjustment for the stinger plate there. The new thing they've added to the dash here is a heater vent, which I think is super cool. Um, You've always got the one down behind your feet there, as well as the snorkel and the walkthrough on the heater that pops out. Um, we, as the driver, it's nice to have the vent shooting right at you. I don't, I don't know why more boats don't have that. Um, and you have your toggle switches for everything else. Supreme's going to have a nice big driver's seat. It does slide, rotate, and bolster up if you need it to. The air dam is option on here to go along with the heater, so kind of close this thing off and you're gonna stay pretty warm on a chilly day out on this boat with the heater on and the air dam in and then up front in the bow we have cup holders a couple more speakers up here optional bow filler cushion so it kind of turns your pickle fork bow it's nice and wide on the ZS into a big playpen seating area which is awesome I like it uh, deep seating as well for a, a bow um, you know, again, nice back support. You feel secure riding or up in the front of this boat. Lastly, we do have the standard mirror on here. And I think that pretty much covers the options and features on the boat. Um, if you have any questions, you can give us a call here at N3. It's 317-845-9253. Visit us on our website at n3boatworks.com. Shoot us a call, or shoot us a text, give us a call. Come check this thing out. Thanks for watching. Signing off.